I have a bachelor's degree in English and international business and a master's degree in emergency management. Emergency management is an area of study that deals with lessening the effects of a natural or man-made disaster. Areas I had to study related to emergency management were meteorology, geology, geography, hydrology, and oceanography. You have to know well how Earth works in order to prevent or lessen the consequences of a natural disaster. In 2019, I wrote the book called 16 Emergency Landings Proving Flat Earth. Not many people know that when I was younger, I worked for an international airline. I worked at the International Cargo and Logistics Division of the company at Sao Paulo International Airport. I had to know all international routes in order to provide our clients the precise information about import and exports as well as the logistics of transporting cargo internationally. Our company transported from a simple parcel package to cars and helicopters to anywhere in the world. Having access to all areas of the airport in 1988, the Brazilian soccer team was about to board their flight towards Australia to take part of the Bicentennial Soccer Cup in Australia. It was a tournament to celebrate Australia's 200th birthday. Two South American teams were invited to take part of this tournament, Brazil and Argentina. At that time, we had access to several maps, all based on the Globe Earth model. The Brazilian squad left to Australia, a natural conclusion is that this charter flight was going to Australia over the Pacific Ocean, as the global model suggests. Perhaps we stopped in Santiago, Chile, and then head to Australia. To my surprise, the flight went to Los Angeles. For several days, I could not comprehend the reason why that flight went to Los Angeles in North America to then go towards Australia in the Southern Hemisphere. This thing kept alive in the back of our mind for all these years. In 2015, I came across YouTube suggestions for Flat Earth videos. My first reaction was to laugh off. After seeing Flat Earth videos in one of my favorite channels, I decided to watch one. When I came across a Flat Earth map, which I had never seen before, it immediately sparked me to look at that flight route, Rio Los Angeles, Sydney. And I could then understand why the Brazilian soccer team went to Los Angeles and then to Australia for the tournament. The Earth is flat, no doubt about it. The following weeks and days were followed by more research and disbelief. I had been a NASA fanboy my whole life, paying two visits to NASA's Johnson Space Center in Huntsville, Alabama, besides spending so much money in science and science fiction related documentaries, movies, merchandise, etc. What a waste of time. Knowing the Earth is flat has placed me in sync with our Creator, His creation, our hidden past, and with the future we hope to build. A future where we should not have an organization called United Nations governing the world. When there is no globe, there should be no globalization. This is my message to all of you. Peace.